Welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne. I'm your host, Ultra Director Jester, and I'm fucking done. I'm done. I just done through with this. I turned cheats back on. I now got infinite HP and MP again. I uh, gave myself some very. I uh, refilled some of my items and giving myself uh, 99. Uh, the fuck? Yeah, 99 repulse spells. So, yeah. That's, that's how we're gonna cut down these random encounters exponentially, but let me tell you, this is the hardest RPG I've ever played. I've never played a game that fought me so hard on screen and off screen. I, I mean, I know Shin Megami Tensei games are supposed to be difficult, but I never expected them to be this fucking tediously difficult. I mean, even in terms of Shin Megami Tensei standards, this is way too goddamn hard. So, here's what we're gonna do. I got four times experience, uh, turned back on. I got 99 repulse spells to cut down the encounter rate. I got infinite MP and HP. I'm fucking done with this shit. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the Labyrinth of Amala. We're gonna grind a little bit, see if we can't get a little stronger, can't get a little better demons, so we can get into the Tunnel of Ikebukuro, defeat those four Oni, and maybe then we can get further on into figuring shit out. I'm sick of people saying, oh, I got the power of creation on my side. I'm gonna take my own power. I'm gonna use it to create a brand new world. Um, no, that's my job, and now I'm gonna use the powers that I have and fucking do that. See, I mean, look, the disc of the extra replay says, unleash the power, beat the game. So I'm gonna unleash the power of the demi fiends and the, the darkness that resides within man and the apocalypse, and I'm gonna use it to finally win and destroy this game. I also figure out that this game is actually on PS3. I mean, I I thought that this game would uh like be one of those PS2 games on PS4, but uh, nope. Should go Digital Devil Saga first, or hell, the Persona games first. Sheesh. I'm kind of glad I did not play this game when it came out on PS2, because. This would have been way too hard for my tastes. Way too hard for a Let's Play, that's for sure. So really, the action replay is kind of speeding this along. And to demonstrate that, I'm going to go ahead and use... All the way down here at the bottom of my items, a Repulse Bell. So now people will leave me the fuck alone. Unless they should leave me the fuck alone. Alright. So now we gotta figure out... Where to go? And now this is an entire fucking labyrinth. Maybe now we can actually think a little bit, move a little quickly, and get a little further. That is my hope, because you know, we haven't gone here yet. I got a feeling there's gonna be just some hole waiting for me. I, I, I feel it coming. That's another barrier. Let's see here. Is this just another? Yep, that's another loop around. It looks like that door is gonna take me to that other area we explored earlier. Hey, we got a bead! Big fucking deal. Yeah, I'm already liking this a hell of a lot better. Yeah. So, again. What I want to do is I want to at least get through this- Oh, that's fucking crazy. I want to get through this first Kalpa first. I guess there's five Kalpas. And, uh, we'll just continue to move on throughout the story if we when we get a little stronger. Or maybe we'll just, uh... Ah. Light levitation and repel. Uh, all that shit wore off, huh? That's fine. So I'll just go ahead and use another one. Aha! I can keep this up all day. Until you start throwing strong enemies my way. So it looks like the best way to go is to fully explore this uh, right area here. Fill out the map while we can. Maybe we can get some answers from there. Is this a door? That is a door. Ooh, what's this here? What do you got to say, man? Described as demons are killed by you know who. I know who? Let's see. Here lies Fornius. Here lies Tr. Oh, oh! These are all the peeps I killed! All the bosses I killed are being lined up one by one in this burial chamber! Right? Is that what's going on here? 
Am I a human or a demon? Well, I guess I'm kind of both. Uh, well... Hmm... I'd say I'm pretty much human. Oh. Well, what if I say I'm a demon? Okay. Alright. Whatever. I mean, Demi-Fiend. Isn't Demi, like, Latin or something for human, or can be tied to human or something like that? So I'd say I'm kind of both. There's a ladder, but I kind of want to see what else we got going on around here. Any, any other helpful souls? Mm-hmm. Come to think of it, I'm pretty sure that the is here, too. Yeah, I think he's, uh, snooping around the Amala network, too. What the fuck is this? Is this just, like, a maze within a maze? Seriously? It all loops around like that. It's so weird. Why is it like that? What is this place? It's just a room with a guy. Did I come here to find nature and be true? <sighs> of course not. Because I learned last time that accepting help from anybody only gets me sent to the fucking beginning. Maybe I should have talked to that guy first and I would have met that couple later and then they, that would have, like, been a test of saying, do you remember not to take help from anyone? I'm not fucking going to, that's for sure. What about you? I'm pretty strong, so there's something special. There you go. Demon that can see through anything. Ooh! 50,000 mecha. I'll fucking take it. Purchased a demon from the Shade Broker. What did I get? Pisaka, eh? Let's take a look at this guy. Pisaka, ooh. Okay. So, uh, what's that skill you got that can make anything easy? A stoma. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. User gains the XP. Just pretty shit. Escape from battle, 100%. Locate treasure on the web. It's supposed to make it easy. That's not what. Nah. Fucking whatever. All right, we've explored everything here. Might as well go check out what's uh, going on in that ladder over here. God, having no random encounters makes it so much easier. So much better. Not a ladder down there. Not the door over here. Uh. Yeah. That's a hole, uh huh. Oh, okay, I can't even get onto that square. It's just whenever there's a hole, I'm just fucked. I thought I was fucked again, but it looks like there's a way out. So. Guess I gotta go this way. Another ladder. So this is just a loop around? Eh, just a fucking loop around. It was, it was a waste of time. An absolute fucking waste of time. Oh boy. Okay. Alright. Yeah, okay. Sure. Alright. Where do we head next then, if that's the case? I mean... Maybe I'll just head north now? Yeah, maybe we'll head... Oh, can't really head... Oh, we can't... Yeah, we can go that way. Let's go down this ladder once more. Maybe we'll take a few random encounters just to make sure we get at least some experience from here. I want to make sure Mizuki changes before we get back to the actual game. Or the, the main story, I suppose. Alright, so he goes silenced, and the enemy gets uh, the leg up on us first, and got me for the weakness, and alright. How are we going to come back from this one? That was not a good thing. It was not a good thing that happened. Hmm. Mm hmm. Yes, lovely. I'm just gonna use tornado and just fuck all y'all up. Die! 
Oh, just die! There. That was 648 XP. That's, that'll, that'll be fine. Uh, I gotta heal Sautahiko, because he's fucking mute. Or silence. Do I got anything that can cure silence? Like a speak ball or whatever? Dis... Well, nope. I don't have dis silence. Does anybody else I know have dis silence? Does not seem like it, so I guess Sato Tahiko's just gonna have to shut the fuck up for a little while. Alright, down this ladder, I suppose. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, now I need to really pay attention to the lights in this next room here. Some of them lead to holes, some of them doesn't. If there's... If there's a light out, that means it's gonna drop me down. And it works on a grid, so... What I need to do is I need to go around here, take this random encounter... Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's better. That's even better. Oh yeah, Feng Wong. Thanks for killing Mizuchi! Feng Wong, you son of a bitch! Why does Charm always fuck me up so goddamn bad? Jesus. Fung Wong, no! You sons of bitches. You did, I mean, yeah, it's great I leveled up, but I wanted fucking Mizuchi to level up, man. Get up my magic a bit for this one, I think. Anti-ice. Ice damage sustained by half? Huh. Hmm. I got a lot of boosts here. A lot of... Huh. I don't know. I'm gonna, I don't think I'm gonna go with that. So I've unleashed the power of Wadatsu. What the fuck does that mean? I have unleashed his power? Or maybe I should uh, equip a better one. Just for, for now. No Ice Weak Fire. There! I'll ingest my asthma so that we have nullified to ice entirely. I'm weak to fire though, but that's okay. Now, uh. Fung Huang, I'm gonna need to use Recarm on Mizuchi. You're the one who killed him, so you're you should be the one who brings him back. And then we'll bring him back into the fray. And a bead chain for all. And shotgun box. And that's how we get this one. And chakra drop obtained. That'll take me down below. So let's just all right, see where this door goes. Another ladder, lovely. It's probably a way back up in case I fall. I'm kind of correct. Looks like most of this is blocked off with a barrier. A barrier I hope to dispel at some point? Okay, not bad. Oh, no, 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 Not you people again. I do not fucking think so. Alright, so this is where we ended up last time. Because there's a couple that made me fuck up. Another door down here. Probably leads to another ladder. I love being right. I feel this, this takes us to a different area, though. Yep. Alright, keep an eye on the damn ceiling. Yep, right there. There's a fucking hole right here. It doesn't lead anywhere. What? What? Oh, I didn't. Mm, I didn't. I didn't pay enough attention. I got careless. That didn't dump me too far, but I'm gonna go ahead and use a repulse bell so we can figure out where it is we're supposed to be going. Maybe dispel some barriers, get some shortcuts or something. Alright. Okay. Let's oh, ah, Last second. Fuck. Okay. Alright. Alright. I 
Because I'll just loop, loop my way around over there. Ow. 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 Oof. Ugh. Dicks. We really have nothing for you, Sara Tahiko. That's, that's ridiculous. Nothing that can cure... Silence. I got something that can silence an enemy, but... I don't have any dismute or anything. Oh, wait, oh, I do. I was looking at silence, not for mute. I'm such a fucking idiot. This game is... <laughs> not what I'm used to. Oh, no, that's taken care of. That little non-crisis averted. Let's get to actually fucking doing this correctly. Hmm. Plenty of holes around here. There's one over there, so I should be heading this way. Okay. Is that another hole I see over there? I think that's like an entire line of holes right over here. There's another one by that door. That's, yeah, that's from earlier, huh? Huh. So... Wait, if that's a hole, that's a hole, and I'll... That's a hole? Well, how the fuck am I supposed to... Get over there, then? I mean, I've, I think I've already been over there, but that's... I think that's all just meant to be a blockade, so I would definitely have to go down there, so this must be the door I have to go through. Hmm. This looks promising. I'm gonna activate the fuck out of this switch. Uh Yeah. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, you're not kidding me. I got to go all the fuck back over there. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, man. Oh, you guys are fucking cruel. You guys are goddamn cruel. You guys, you guys understand this? Oh man, Atlas. See, I'm using a Game Facts guide. One of the things I like about Game Facts is that uh, they have like uh, input from other users, so you can you can tell like. Uh, what the hardest role-playing game for the PS2 is, what the easiest, uh, action game for the Xbox 360 is. You know, it's, uh, it's really cool. I like that stuff. This is apparently the second hardest PlayStation 2 role-playing game on the system. And I think, like, the 23rd or, like, 26th hardest PS2 game overall. So, Alright. We need to head over there. Somehow. To do that, I have to probably go back up and go back the other way from the very beginning of the fucking of the fucking dungeon alright alright and it's yeah. these barriers man they're making me go all the way around it's just tedium now there's no challenge anymore, it's just tedious. Well, okay, there's plenty of challenge by that. I mean, there's a lot of insane bullshit difficulty. Oh, okay. We gotta head back over here. I kind of feel like uh, talking to that couple who get me drunk and send me back to the beginning would be faster. Yeah, we're doing alright so far. Again, I, I just want Mizuchi to evolve. At least a little bit. Get, get him a bit stronger, get my party up there before we uh, end up fusing more demons, which might be coming up soon. Good, good. Experience of the bottom. Yes. <coughs> anyway, getting experience is good. So now we need to find a way to get down there. So it looks like this door is the way to go. And it looks like there is a way to get through that door. So here we go. It's locked! It's fucking locked! <laughs> okay. Maybe there's a key over here or something. I've already 
Batman the fuck over here? God! Oh, where is this? Where the fuck do they want me to go? Hmm? Where am I supposed to go? That door is fucking locked, huh? There's goddamn barriers everywhere! What am I supposed to do? Alright, I'm throwing a repulse spell back on. So we can figure where the fuck we're supposed to fucking be fucking going. Jeez. I'm gonna try going down this center console again, I suppose. There's something here we may have missed. Huh. Alright, that's a good sign. We can now go down this ladder. I don't remember if we could before, but hey, we can now. Ah, this looks... This looks new. I like new. I like progress. Progress is good. Okay. Oh. Well. This looks familiar. Check out the people. What's in here? I hope it doesn't send me back to the beginning again. Let's find out. Woo! Looks like a bloodstream, like I'm in a fucking human or something like that. Ladies and gentlemen, the most enigmatic RPG in history, Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne! I've got, like, three candelabrum right now. Oh yeah! No kidding, kids! They're pretty fucking tough. The Vortex World? Oh, I've got, pl I've got plenty of no understanding. I got... I don't need knowledge, I need strength. Unless if there's strength in knowledge, but... Alright, so what do we got? We, we, okay, we're not getting any knowledge, we're just getting... Oh, here we go. We're getting knowledge now. There's a light whose sole purpose is to empower the one who will oversee creation. So it's pretty much a gigantic fuck-off spirit bomb. Creation is yet to bring a new world to existence be possible by the annihilation of the old world. Well, I don't think they did a very good job of annihilating the old world. There's... How are there still humans walking around here? Why is it that ordinary humans can live in this world easier than I can with my demi-fiend abilities? How does that make any sense? <sighs> so, the source of all Kazu Kagutsuchi is probably at the bottom of this labyrinth, and I'm gonna take that power, and I'm gonna make a new world, and I'm gonna make a new Shin Megami Tensei world that's better than this one. Man, I should have done Digital Devil Saga instead. So even, you've seen like billions and billions of world- well, man, you must have been around for like quadrillions of years because... Our Earth itself is four billion years old, so if you watch worlds die, you know, countless worlds live and die, I can't imagine how long that must have been. So, um, as far as I can tell, we didn't learn anything new, really. Kagasuchi's powerful, everybody wants Kazu Kagasuchi creates a new world by destroying the old world. I don't have any new powers or any new abilities to show for this, so, yeah. I wonder where else is gonna take me. Effective repel war off, that's fine. It's a shaft leading downward. Well, let's jump in, maybe you got more, uh, fun flying shit, or maybe it'll take me back to the fucking beginning. I don't- I don't know anymore! I have no idea what to expect from this game anymore. This was certainly a surprise. Let's see if they can throw in- they can, uh, throw some curveballs. Ah! That's a curveball. Yep, yep. 
Oh man, it's got the inverse controls I can't get used to. Ah! Oh, that, that, shit. Ugh. This reminds me of getting the Chaos Emeralds in Sonic Heroes. I hate, I hate that. <laughs> At least we got some money out of the deal. Where does that take us? The second Kalpa? Wait, 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 wait. What happened to the first? Why couldn't I... H hang on. H how am I in the second Kalpa already? If I... I don't think I even finished the first one. D do I know what cause I... S I would... Uh... I end my dealings with a fallen angel before my heart is consumed by darkness. I think I got plenty of fucking darkness in my heart right now. I'd rather not thanks by. Woe unto me because, uh... Yeah, I think you're... You, you don't sound like a good guy. is this god guy now you're fucking telling me that not only all my friends all my enemies but now god is against me i'm not even sure if the old lady and the fucking guy in the wheelchair are on my side so that's right let's light the candelabrum of dignity because i certainly don't have a whole lot of it left let in eternity too sure Throw that on there as well. At least the candelabrums are starting to make more sense. I think I need to find those special ones and keep coming back every so often. Alright, this is working alright, I suppose. But... Still don't know what this all has to... I mean... How is this the second culpa? Or over here. That's that's a shaft leading down to the Wait! Wait! What? Hang on! What? Does this just lead forward onto the What the fuck? What the hell? What the hell? No, I'm I'm fine, but what the fuck are you? Oh man. I mean, there's a thing down here, there's a shaft back there, there's more of the first Kalpa I haven't explored because of these fucking barriers and that goddamn locked door. Uh, so, uh, I... What am I supposed... <laughs> I've never been more lost. Oh, this... Okay, this returns me to the entrance. Uh... You know, that doesn't sound like a bad idea. So, alright, if, if this takes me back to the entrance of the labyrinth, I'm gonna have to do another one of these... Yeah, another one of these minigames again. Do I gotta do this every single time I wanna go save? Uh... I mean, it's fun and all, but... Yeah. I feel like having me do this all the time isn't a great... Kind of kills pacing a little bit, is what I'm saying. Just, just a little. Oh, I got my dismute back. Nice. All right. Now we're starting to make sense. All right. All right. I get it now. So next time on Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne, we'll give the second Kalpa a little delving into. See you next time.